This video will focus on copying, moving, and deleting documents, as well as editing existing document profiles. We'll start by looking at copies. I'm in Microsoft Word. I'm going to click on File Open, which will activate World Docs. You then locate the file that you'd like to copy and select the Copy Toolbar button at the top. Okay, the Copy Profile form will pop up and all the original fields will be populated with the same information, so you may need to go in and make some editing changes. I'll assign this to a different matter. If there are multiple versions to the document, you can copy all of the versions at the same time. Just make sure that you check off this box also. And then click on the Copy button. Okay, World Docs will then give you a chance to open up the file if you'd like. If you answer yes, the file will open in Microsoft Word and you can make your changes. File moves may need to be performed if you've assigned oh, a document to an incorrect matter or quite possibly you have an old profile group for legacy documents and you want to move batches of documents at one time. So I'll first go and locate my documents. I'm going to go to my old profile group, Active Branch. Let's expand out my documents. And I'm going to go into the Marketing folder. And I will check off all of these files because I want to move them all at the same time into the same new location in the new profile group. So select. And then up at the top, I click on the Move Toolbar button, the seven that are checked. Assign them to the appropriate client, project, and doc type. I'm just going to assign a miscellaneous doc type at this point because they may represent a mixture of different doc types, but I do want to move them at this time as a batch. I'm going to select assign auto name, which will change from the existing file name to the new World Docs unique file number, and then click on move. and all the files are now moved. Through use of my favorite files tool, I can go to the moved category and very quickly locate those documents that I just moved. They're right here at the top of the list. When you'd like to delete a file, simply select the file or files by checking off the boxes adjacent to the files. And then up at the top in the toolbar area is a red X. Looks like it's drawn with a paintbrush. Click on that two files that are checked, and you will have some of these choices or all of these choices. The top choice will put it into a location in World Docs called the salvage bin where it can be retrieved. Typically items will stay in the salvage bin for 30 to 45 days, and if they are not retrieved during that time period, they will be permanently deleted. Delete, it will be eliminated from the system. Shredding eliminates it from the system and puts it in such a state that it could never ever be reconstructed. It's typical on new installations to give you the choice to move it to the salvage bin so that it can always be retrieved. So I'm going to make that selection, click on OK, and the files are deleted. Finally, we're going to look at editing the profile for an existing document. Here I have a document which appears to be a PowerPoint manual. I'm going to select it, look at the profile by clicking on the Edit Profile button in the toolbar. And you'll notice that this has been assigned a doc type of miscellaneous. So I may want to further categorize this by clicking on Doc Type and selecting Training Manual. And then click on OK. It is also possible to select multiple files at the same time, edit the profiles as a group to make quick changes to all the files. I'm going to assign the author of T. Smola to all these, click on OK, and they very quickly get changed. That will conclude your introduction to copying, moving, deleting files, as well as editing document profiles.